Hello, and welcome back to Burn My Bread, a Persona 3 playthrough featuring me, Toasty, a new media sensation blending virtual entertainment tubers with the rich flavor of artisanal baked bread products your family will love. Hello, and check out this naughty boy. Look at this naughty boy looking over at, the, at my personas over there. He's like, I'm gonna steal them. I'm gonna steal those personas. You're not gonna steal those personas. Go back in the box. Because it's time to enjoy a wonderful time with our after school friends. And this after school friend that we're gonna spend time with today is Odagiri. The Nark. I can grow closer with Takemi Kazuchi. That's true. I can't. I can do that. Oh, hello. Today's meeting is canceled. Okay, we're done here then, I guess. Um, I'll go home. Did Odagiri-san do something? Uh, he does a lot of things. What do you mean? A teacher came by earlier and called him to the faculty office. Oh... Odagiri's in trouble. That teacher seemed really upset. Did something happen? That head to the faculty office. Every time in school, when somebody got called out of the school, they'd be like, Ooh. He was appointed to the student council by the president herself. He's a responsible person. Me? Tostason? That's why I didn't add him to the suspect list. I'm not a suspect. You know there are witnesses who've seen him wandering the streets late at night, don't you? The, yeah, but the midnight... The, I'll, I'll explain the midnight hour. It'll all make sense. It's not that I doubt the witness reports. It's more that I trust him. So I'm not adding him to the list. Oda Giri. I really thought you were smarter than this. Well, you thought wrong. That was your fault. You can go ahead and forget about our deal. <gasps> not the deal. Me, then? So, you heard all that. Nope, didn't hear anything. Let's go get some food. Oh, listen, it wasn't me. I don't even know really what we're talking about. I know. A cigarette, but me. I think. That teacher suspects you of all people. How he ever got certified is a mystery to me. Don't worry. Even if the whole school turns on me, I'll have your back. Wow. I respect that. Thank you. He seems to care about me a lot. I feel like we're becoming better friends. Honestly, kind of an unexpected turn for, the, for Odegi. I'll have your back. You're starting to rub off on me. Yeah, like, you'd expect him to be like, I don't trust nobody except the law. See you later. This is the power of our friendship. If only we could have made that other guy less of a, like, enabler of pedophilia. Hi, right, how was your day? It was okay. You know, it was alright. What you got there? Is that your game gear? Should have a PSP, frankly. Ah, Mitsuru, reading the book, the PSP of the the book world. Um. Okay. Now, there's a lot of things we could do. We had some things unlocked. We could go ahead and spend some time with Akihiko. Um, but you know where my heart is. You know what I really want to do. None of that. Honestly, there's only one thing for me. There's only one thing that will make my heart happy. Only one thing that can fill the great void inside of me and us all. And that's eating at Wakatsu Kitchen. Give me that kitchen. Mmm. Give me that prod prodigy plan. 
Oh, it's delicious. Mmm, brain food. Tastes like delicious slice of bread. Ding dong, bing bong. And that's how it's done. Now it's school time. Everyone understand the Lawrence Force and the left hand rule? And I'm erasing the board. Screw all this noise. My shoulders feel lighter than usual today. Can I erase the top of the blackboard with ease? Oh, well, that's nice. You've been working out? Perhaps because I went to the bathhouse yesterday. A nice long massage in the whirlpool bath. Wow. That brings us to my next question. Do you know of a good place to get a massage? When streams of air bubbles from a whirlpool bath hit you, your body vibrates. Yeah? There's actually a name for this phenomenon. Iori, do you know what it is? What? Uh, dude, how would I know? You haven't told us. Hey, you got any idea? What's it called? Oh, a, um, uh, the bubble jet phenomenon. Because it's bubble jets. But the flutter effect? It's like the butterfly effect. But not copyright. I don't know if it's copyright. You got it. Flutter refers to the small vibrations generated by interaction between airflow and other forces. It's not just whirlpool baths that have that benefit. You ever feel itchy after taking a regular bath? It's said that taking a warm bath can improve blood circulation throughout the body. And as the body warms up, the blood vessels dilate, flushing your body of toxins all at once. Heat can stimulate the secretion of histamine, which often makes the body itch. Hot baths may feel marvelous, but it's best to take them in moderation. Lukewarm water, on the other hand, helps cleanse the skin. I digress. Now then, let's get back to class. Open your books to page 8. <laughs> Man, now I want to take a dip in a whirlpool bath. Think we'd ask Carijo Senpai for one in the dorm? To get one? To, to get one? Wasn't he asking for something like to get a beach or something last time? Can we get a beach for the, <laughs> for the dorm? I don't know if he understands, like, physics. I don't mean, like, the school kind. I mean, just, like, causality. This place in the world. Kenji. You mother slicing son of a bread. Son of a yeast. Am I, am I the son of a yeast? Because I'm a bread? Hmm. Really makes you think. Okay. I'm gonna go to find Case K. Case K. Uh, let's go here. Case K. In the art room. And go to the fart room, more like it. Ha! <laughs> fart room. Yeah, there you are. There you are, you fortunate boy. Do I have a fortune? Let's see if we have a fortune man. I do. It's Sandman, the sneaky devil who wants to steal your treasures. Hello. Oh, Toaster Simkun. About to head the club. What are you gonna do today? I feel like we can grow closer thanks to insane demand. Oh, well, let's go to the fart club. Uh huh. Ooh, draw whatever I want. Oh, nice. And this is the phallus. Let's wrap up for today. Good work, everyone. Whew, all done. All right, let's clean up and go home. Oh. Oh no. What? 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 What happened? What happened? This has been happening a lot lately. It's just a little headache. 
I don't think it's anything to worry about. Oh, hold on. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Nothing to worry about. All you good really here. Figure out what's causing the pain. It might lead to serious complications down the road. Oh my gosh. Case okay. Does anywhere else hurt? Are your nose and throat all right? Mr. Doctor. Does it feel like your head is in a vice? That's that's a lot of questions to ask. Oh boy, here we go. Case case and by strikes again. Oh, female club then, but thanks. You know what I'm saying. He's a so little much, right? On, we'll be going anywhere for a while. Ugh. Strikes again? What do you mean? If someone isn't feeling well, he always tries to figure out what's wrong. Ugh. This it guy. doesn't matter when or where. Once he starts, it takes forever. Why don't you go be a school noise? Case you case seem to be better at it than the actual the noises. Hospital, and he's an only child. I guess he just can't stand to see people suffer. I bet he'll end up going to medical school. So the pain's originating from the back of your head? Could you turn around, please? Ah, don't worry. It's just a chronic tension type headache. I can Most see Most likely now. the result of stress. I can see, based on the back of your head, that you have a chronic tension type headache. You might be spending too much time in front of the computer. Try to get outside and exercise more. It's because you'd be on that phone. It must seem funny to get medical advice from the head of the art club. I was worried I'd come down with the flu or something. In that case, I can do a more thorough check. I know what you mean. Could you remove your shirt? Also, open your Okay, I do know what you mean, I guess. Right here? What? Our dorm isn't far, so he can accompany me back. Uh, sorry, sorry. Wait, you two live in the dorms? I guess I see it in Yamagishi-san. She seems like the well-adjusted type. I bet you're a great cook. Do you take care of the laundry? Is living alone hard? Uh, there's a lot of questions. He seems like uh, the the kind of kid where they just ask you 500 questions Sorry, in a row. Yamagishi san I forgot about your condition. I know it's close, but I don't think you should be walking home. Why don't I call you a taxi? Though a bumpy taxi ride might make your headache worse. Maybe a limousine would be better. Can limousines avoid uh, the bumps? That's okay. I mean, I'm fine. I'll take really? it. But... You know, maybe a helicopter is best. I'm gonna medical lift you back to your house. Oh, welcome back. Do -do 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 -do. All right, we are back. <sighs> Limited meal set that to a katsu. Gotta go. Don't even gotta think about it. Gimme. Yes. Seafood full course. Fill me up with that seafood delight. I sense the Omega 3s inside of me. There's still three. Hello? Good morning. This is Elizabeth. Oh, th hello. I am calling to inform you that more humans have wandered into Tartarus. More humans? Two this time, I believe. Please swiftly and safely conduct a search and rescue. What are they doing? I know. You wandering into Tartarus? It's the school at night. Everything's scary there. Why would you go inside? These kids, who's going into the, into the Tartarus during the midnight hour? Do something else. Ugh. 
listen, if I woke up during the midnight hour, you know where I would be? In my house. I'd look around and I'd say, oh, everything's all green here. Oh well, better continue playing Hades 2 or whatever it is I'm doing. Um, okay, Odigiri in the con in the student council. Hey, hey Odigiri. Hey buddy. Time to hang out. Now I think. the disciplinary committee's forecast report. Thanks. Next up is the treasurer's report. Yes. Sorry, but I was hoping you had some time once this meeting's over. Shut up, I'm listening to the treasurer report. We can talk up on the roof. I don't care, I'm listening to the treasure report. Gotta hear about this treasure. I'm sorry to drag you up here, but I wanted to tell you something. The cigarette butt incident is going to be dropped. It seems interrogating every student in the school raised a few concerns. It seems that no one actually cared that much. I wanted to be student council president next year. That teacher promised to endorse me if I agreed to help him. But I lost any hope of achieving that when I spoke up against him. Not to mention the student body isn't so fond of me. I rambled on about rules and fairness, but all I really proved was that I was desperate for power. Ah, uh, well, I'm glad you realized it. See, now I understand why the president asked you to join the student council. You don't say things to put people down. You're just honest with them. Sometimes. Sometimes I just lie to people because that's what will get me the most points. The system only works if you have people's trust. And trust isn't something you can force on anyone. When that teacher doubted you, I felt backed into a corner by a fool who simply had more power than me. I felt like the truth was being distorted and that I might lose a friend as a consequence. If it wasn't for you, I would have become a tyrant. So, thank you. He seems truly grateful. I feel like we're becoming better friends. He was gonna like become like the next Don't you like. Dare repeat what I just said to anyone. He was gonna become like the antagonist in Persona Five, but we like talked him out of it, and he was like, hmm. You're right. I won't become the antagonist in Persona 5. I realize it's out of my usual character. I'm sure everyone would just make fun of me. Just promise, okay? I'll see you later. You damn brats! I'll sue! Hello, Akihiko. Alright. Now. Oh, now I think we're gonna go to. Let's see. Hmm, difficult choice. Hmm, all the things we could do. I don't know. Let's check. Uh, let's check the network. What did most people do? Let's see, we had. 8% spend time with Mutatsu. Don't know if I know who that is. 70% uh, with the Tataris. Rescued the Miyama. Kenjiro Tsumi. Hmm. You know what I think we'll do? I think we'll go to Wakatsu Kitchen. I think we're gonna go to Wakatsu Kitchen. The, the wisdom of the crowd has determined we must go to Wakatsu Kitchen. Get the full course. Still not a four. Gotta get a four. Ploink. 27 sat. 27 sat. So 28 could stand. Whoa, the couple's falling unconscious together. Ooh. Kind of romantic to sleep for eternity with your lover or 
for the night. How about instead of sleeping for eternity with your lover, sleeping for the night with your lover? No way. Not romantic at all. That's right. She's going to say what I said. I'm going to say, I think it's the sleeping together for the night is a lot better. Okay. Whoa. Healthy brain food. Healthy brain food. No, not during the day. I must restrain myself. Um. Okay. Because today, Saturday, one of the few days we are able to actually hang out with Yuko. We gotta do that. Do we have a strength? We do. Matador! Hey, uh. Olay! All right. Where should we go? How about my place? Oh! No! Don't worry, I tied up beforehand. <laughs> oh yeah, you did. Sorry, the party ended up being at my place. Oh, don't. I was out buying stuff that might be useful for running practice, and I ran out of money. How about spending a night? You know what I mean? This is a nice room. Yeah, pretty nice room you got here. Oh, you go. Really? Good thing I took the time to tidy up. I like your muscle posters in the background. Is that super punch out? It looks like Little Mac up there. Feel free to eat as many snacks as you want, okay? Oh, snacks. It was a lot of hard work. Oh, hey. But I'm glad we decided to Look up there. The kids in the end. There's a hidden Mickey. You see the hidden Mickey? Up, up there by the by the, the soccer sportsman. What do you think? <sighs> sorry, I got distracted by the hidden Mickey. Um, sorry. It's just... I never noticed how long your eyelashes are. I don't think I've looked at you this closely before. Oh, really? Oh my. It's only the two of us here now. Maybe that's why I'm a little nervous. Oh, is it? Uh, how about we change the subject? Hmm. I'll ask you a question. The night. Hmm. Oh, do you like children? Oh my, isn't this a little forward of you? Well, uh, I do. I don't, but uh, I'll tell you I do. I'll tell you that I do, so it's Really? Uh, me too. I like how they're so pure and always try their best. Because I'm alive. It just makes me want to support them as much as I can. I realized recently how much I like to look after other people. Let's see. Uh, okay, next question. Okay, is this it? Do you have your interview sheet? Let's say you get married and have a kid. Uh-huh. Would you want it to be a boy or a girl? Um, Goyle. Me too. Oh, we must be on the same wavelength. Oh wow. I would dress her up in all kinds of different outfits. Oh, she could be my little helper. Okay, now let's say you were to get married to someone. What would the theme be like? What are you thinking of color schemes? Like, do you think you want to do like doilies on the table? Uh, or maybe a centerpiece. Do you, have a, do you have a flower preference for that? Either way, I would just hope that the baby didn't take after me. You could say I'm a little rough around the edges. But if they took after you, I'm sure they'd be super cute. Wait, do you mean like you're not beautiful? Listen, you are they beautiful. Be too. Girl, girl, in sports. you gotta have more belief in yourself, okay? Everybody is beautiful. Like, would I choose a different lipstick? Maybe. But that's not your fault. Way, it's not, you well, like it's not genetic, mom. I'll say. You're tr I've been told that I'm the spitting image of my dad. Not that I mind, but I do have mixed feelings about it. I mean, we don't look that much alike, right? My eyebrows aren't as bushy for one. How do people get bushy eyebrows anyway? Do you have to shave them?
That's very funny. Oh, welcome back. That went from like the the tension in the air was palpable, and then it quickly descended into, "Hey, look at the picture of my dad. What do you think about my dad's eyebrows?" A very smooth move, I gotta say. All right, now this hurts. Me. It really hurts me that we can't. We have to do this, but. Gotta meet up with Tanaka. We gotta meet up with Tanaka because he's a he's a toughie. He's the tough man to find to track down. He's busy. Oh. I'd love to go to Wakatsu, but I'm afraid we have to do something else today. My schedule is so terribly packed. I don't usually have time for your average Joe, you know. Oh, really? You should be glad you're such a handsome boy. Everybody is complimenting my looks today. From from all across the the generations. Alright. Let's add a new word to our vocabulary today. Repeat after me. After me. Placebo. Mmm. The stress is on the middle syllable. Placabo. Placa placabo. Very good. You're feigning interest well. Thank you. A placebo is a pretend pill. Basically, it's a medicine to give you peace of mind. Imagine this. A supplement to eliminate those unsightly love handles without lifting a finger. Or... A car navigation system that uses real-time image data to make your commute all the smoother. Ooh. Or at least make it feel that way. These are just a fraction of our unique line of products. Wow. Those do seem pretty dangerous to offer to people. But... You're really wowed by those bogus products? I suppose one could see them as rather spectacular. Our business Maybe doesn't I shouldn't buy things off the Tanaka benefits. channel anymore. It provides peace of mind. Take emergency supplies, for example. People feel safe just because they have them, don't they? Yeah. As it turns out, the more money people spend, the better they feel. I see. So you're saying that we should make the emergency supplies fake and bad and not work because people just want to feel safe for having them. They wouldn't want to actually use them in an emergency. They're just for decoration. I get it now. This makes sense to me. Now then, that's it for today's lesson. You can pay me back when you make your first million. I feel closer to the devil. Every day, closer and closer to the devil. You didn't tell anyone. Did you? If you go back on your word, you might be surprised to find your profile suddenly on an internet dating site. Oh, you do that for me? Oh, that's nice. I've been thinking about getting out there, you know, putting myself out, spreading, spreading my wings. See if see if I could really find someone who gets me. I appreciate that, Tanaka. He's such a nice man. Hmm. Well, better buy something from Tanaka. It's amazing commodity. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Good, good. Emronian sprout. Okay. Not bad, kid. Buff potato sprout. Okay. He's proven himself to be very reliable. Thanks, kid. Bye bye. Well, I feel good about what we've done today. <laughs> and 
I will feel good about it tomorrow as well, I imagine. So, I will see you another time on Burn My Bread, a Persona 3 playthrough featuring me, your pal Toasty. Bye bye now. Da 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 ba da ba 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 da ba ba da da ba 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 ba